I'm a scientist working at the University of Michigan School of Natural Resources and Environment, and I study forest ecosystems. So for our work, we, we collect data on forest um, performance in the field, and then we use that data to develop mathematical models to predict future performance of these forests. So this graph reflects the kind of work we do. We have collected data in the field on how tulip poplar, a common species here, growth, um, grow. And what we have here is growth of these particular species as a function of temperature during the spring. And what we do is to generate these lines using mathematical models, and they allow us to predict not only how much this species is going to grow under current conditions, this black line, but also how this species is, may be able to grow under warmer temperatures, which is our red line right here. So using this combination of field data and mathematical models, now we can forecast how different species may grow under different climate scenarios. And that information will be very useful to manage and conserve forest ecosystems. So the most enjoyable part of my job is that we get to combine both field data and mathematical modeling. So we are able to um, study these uh, different organisms and then abstract their performance using mathematical models. So now it's your turn to predict how other species may respond to warming climate.